In Mario Kart Wii, every track has a staff ghost. This ghost is often a time many players try and beat. Today, my goal is to beat every single staff ghost in a row without resetting a single time. However, the original Nintendo staff ghosts just don't cut it anymore with their driving being very obsolete. Instead, I'm going to be racing every single CTGP staff ghost to give myself a greater challenge. I hope you enjoy. Alright guys, so the first track, Luigi Circuit, should be pretty easy. Um, we do have the speed advantage, you can see we're on the spear. They are on the mock bike, <laughs> Luigi mock bike. Uh, only thing I gotta worry about this one is just not hitting any pipes. Should be pretty free though. Um, I think I've beaten this ghost by almost 4 seconds already, so as long as we don't have any uh, big mess ups, <laughs> we should be okay. Yeah, even with that, we're still ahead. Let's see if we make it lap two, better than lap one. Yeah, pretty cleanly. As you can see, we're absolutely crushing the ghost right now. We don't even need to go for the shortcuts, I don't think, but we're still going to. You know. And, yep, pretty easy, and there we go. That's Luigi Circuit. So, although Wario might be a fierce competition, um, a lot of the tracks in this are just going to be auto-scrollers, to be honest. I don't really see me messing up a lot of the easier ones, um, but this challenge is mainly about consistency. So, like, I'm not even going to go for the low trick there. Um, he goes for it, but it's, it's just not needed to beat him. Um, it might be needed now, because we just lost uh, 1.5 seconds, so... I'm gonna shut up and I'm gonna, you know, lock in here. <laughs> Final lap two. Definitely catching him. It's a pretty good lap there. Barely beating it. Holy, the comeback. <laughs> I had to really focus there, guys. Uh, lap one was pretty, pretty bad, so let's move on. So we got Toad on the jet bubble here. Should be another easy ghost here. Um, beating this one by over five seconds already in time trials. Um, however, as you saw last race, it's all about the consistency. We just need to not make any dumb mistakes, not fail the gap jump, <laughs> not fall off before it, don't do anything silly. Should be good. Yep. Two seconds ahead. <laughs> there we go. 143. Crushing the ghost by about three seconds. So Sweet. And now I can speak, because I, <laughs> I got past the hardest part. Um, so this ghost, I've beaten by 14 seconds already, with the glitch, keep in mind, 7th worldwide. However, um, it's on a cart, so as long as we don't fall off, uh, we should be beating this. <laughs> I'm gonna save my mushroom here, actually. Um, our lap 1 was kind of slow, so to beat the Stompers lap 3, we would have needed a really fast lap here, so um, we're just gonna play it safe. Keep our shroom for lap 3. So here we are, we've got our shroom. And yeah, just look at the minimap, we're just breaking away completely. So, even if we fall off, I think we're still beating them, so... Let's just round out. Highest electric ever, but 151.1, so we beat it by about 8 seconds. So, another spear track. We didn't necessarily need the spear, because they are on mock bike, but um, I figured why not. Um, one bad thing is, is I'm actually not that great with the spear. Um, and I'm going for all the world record strats right now, and I'm failing them. <laughs> um, but this one, again, should just be another easy one. The only reason I'm going for the ramp is because um, the only way we lose to this ghost, really, is if we get hit by the chain chomp. So, and also if we can't catch up to them with our two shrooms. <laughs> Um, but we're on pace to beat it by about three seconds right now, so, um, as they have no more mushrooms left, so we should be good here. 
I'm gonna go for this ramp still. Don't wanna. Don't wanna risk getting chomped there. Yeah, I totally could have gone and hit there if I. Uh, did what I just did. Um, oh, horrible driving, but you know we're ahead and we have an extra mushroom, so. Again, not getting the air, but it's fine. <laughs> um, as we still have a mushroom, so. Just hit no more, hit no Goombas here. We should be good. That's Mario Circuit. Coconut Mall, one of uh, one of the fans' favorites, that's for sure. Um, very good track, um, and a pretty easy staff ghost. So as long as we don't do any silly mistakes, we should be good to beat this one. Um, while I have some downtime, I'm going to talk about some of the ghosts we kind of have to worry about. So, Rainbow Road, I've only beaten by about one second, uh, and it's probably my worst track. So, that ghost could be a little tricky for us, but um, I don't, I don't think so. Too, I don't think it'll be too bad. Um, and then RBC or, R, uh, or N64 Bowser's Castle is the last track in the game, and that's probably the second hardest staff ghost, other than uh, Rainbow Road. So. Um, I've beaten both before, but they could be uh, they could be tricky for us. So we'll have to see when we get there. There we go. One fifty nine point five. Pretty bad, but we beat the staff ghost, and that's all that matters. So another uh, another easy one. We got to get a one fifty nine here. Um, however. Failing the double and uh, driving poorly like we are right now could be the downfall of us. So, um, uh, let's see if we let's see if we got it. Should be good. Oh, weird error, but yeah, we make it. Oh my goodness, hitting the shy guy, <laughs> going the wrong way. Oh my goodness. Still only like yeah, less than a hundred milliseconds behind. Kind of shocking because that was a that was a lap for sure. <laughs> Hitting another shy guy. I'm gonna have to shroom. Holy. <laughs> so we're down a shroom, but we're up about a second. Yeah. So we should be fine. No shy guys, and we should be good. And that's DK Summit. Should be another easy one here. Um, it's on a cart, so I'm sure you guys can see why. Um, I just thought about it though. Um, a burnout could be lethal for us, so um, we gotta make sure we don't do any burning out. And I forgot to use my mushroom, but it's fine. <laughs> um, wall jumps. It's not gonna do anything silly here. Uh, thinking of other tracks that could be bad for us uh, for one uh, try uh, attempts, um, Grumble Volcano could be a little hard because you have to do make you actually have to make the the rock hop twice and then do the respawn. Um, Bowser's Castle three because you have to do the uh, the shortcut three times could be a little tricky. Um, just trying to think what else. Those two especially. So we gotta. We have about four tracks left that could be uh, could be bad for us if we don't uh, if we don't lock in. Not even gonna risk the wall bounce here. Definitely not worth it. Um, as you can see on the mini map, we're doing really well against the ghost here. So I'm not even risking that path with the card on it. <laughs> Failing to detach two for two. Um, yeah, that's gold mine. Daisy Circuit is probably one of the, the harder ones that we've done so far, however, um, it won't be that bad. We just need to not do any silly mistakes, not bounce over any more boost panels, and uh, yeah, we should crush this one. Not hit any cones either, let's stay, stay away from the cones. Again, let's do the cut like it is, and oh, no truck, we should be fine now, yeah, we're pretty far ahead, as long as we don't hit any, uh, any walls, we should be good here. Uh, that's Daisy Circuit.
beat by about two seconds. Another easy one here. We're playing Koopa Cape uh, versus a Bullet Bike. So we should be good. Just not going to do anything crazy. Um, no no risky strats. No any, nothing, nothing like that. Not going for the Mando strat. We're just going to be shrooming up here, I believe. Um, and yeah, this one should be easy. And actually, we got the detach. That's like really fast. That's like world record level right there. <laughs> or faster. Oh, can't hit any zappers. Holy, I forgot. Completely forgot about those things. That would have been bad. Thought we wouldn't have needed, uh... We would have needed, uh, the pick up the pace. <laughs> we hit one of those. Right, looks like we're going all over the place, but... If you look at the mini-map, we're just destroying the Koopa, so should be okay here. And that's Koopa Cape! So another easy one, it's uh, it's actually a cart, so um, it's good news for us. Um, I've beaten this one by about 9 seconds um, already, so as long as we don't do any big mistakes, we should be okay. Um, it's a 227, so... Oh, our first, almost our first fall off there. That was really scary. <laughs> Some scary wiggler patterns, but looks like we're going to be okay. Um, probably could have gone to the left of that one there, but, you know. Oh, going up the zipper for fun, I guess. And, yeah, beat it by about four seconds, even with all that bad driving. So, I'll take it. <laughs> So, this is actually our um, our first decently scary ghost, and that is because um, the rock hop. We have to do the rock hop twice, and me, I'm okay at the rock hop, but I'm definitely not practiced up on it, and failing it would be the end. So, we gotta, we gotta lock in here. I'm gonna focus up here, guys. Uh, there we go. Made it once. Not uh, not very great, but good enough. <laughs> there we go. We made it twice. That's exactly what we need. <laughs> One and a half seconds ahead. We should be good now. Um, I was only worried about the rock hop, but um, looks like we got to do it. So. I was going to say, let's not do that, but we did it anyways. And the ghost goes around the cut, which I didn't even know. So, I thought we had to do the respawn, but it doesn't do it. <laughs> so, 147.4. Beat it by about two and a half seconds there. Um, we'll take it. So, one thing about DDR is uh, the ghost is really bad. It's a 203. I have a 148 to keep in mind. However, there's a lot of strats on this track, so um, things could go south really, really quickly. Um, however, we're making the sand top lap one, so... Should be okay, um, but mostly just sand hop and uh, wall glitch is what we're gonna have to be careful of. Um, but looks like we're gonna be able to do both. Oh, barely not. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Pretty rough lap so far. And we're throwing as much time as we can, so that's good news. Oh my gosh. It's enough air to make <laughs> to make the cut three times over. Um, I'm, saying, I'm saying we just go for the ultra, just for fun. I don't know. I think we'll be okay beating this ghost, so. Let's see if we can do it. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> <laughs> we fell off. It's our first uh, fall off besides the rock. Besides respawn. Yeah, and even with a fall off, we're, we're still beating it. So, <laughs> nice. So, this one, 
Should be another easy one, however. Um, there's a lot of cars on this track, and if we hit one or get squished by one, it could be very bad. So, uh, you know, we're going to play how we always play, but we're just going to be a little cautious because hitting a car or uh, getting squished could be the end of us. So, um, let's see what we got in us. Let's see what we got. Oh my god, dude. I forgot about the truck. <laughs> Probably the most uh, scuffed shroom strut ever, maybe. Is a tr car there? Yeah. Um, we need to lock in because this is looking a little shaky. Um, however, we do have a decent lead. Um, there's a truck here. It looks so wide. I do not want to get squished. Yeah, there's another truck here. I knew that too. <laughs> Um, let's just get to the line before I get before I get flattened. There we go. We beat it. <laughs> one forty-eight. Or, yeah, one forty-eight. So Bowser's Castle should be uh, more than easy as long as we don't fall off or do anything stupid. We're racing a cart, as you can see. So um, yeah, we're gonna shroom. Um, in the meantime, next track is Rainbow Road, which is probably the track I'm most scared for. Um, the track is really hard, and <laughs> I'm not that good at it. So, um, yeah, I definitely don't want to reset and do all the tracks again, because uh, that would take a, lot, a long time, of 40 minutes probably. So, um, Rainbow Road better be good. That's all I'm saying. So we better get a good Rainbow Road. Oh my lord. <laughs> good thing we had a big lead. Um, we're still going to be beating it, even with that <laughs> thwomp hit. Alrighty. Beat it by two seconds. Alright guys. The truck we've all been waiting for. I really hope I get this. Um, yeah. <laughs> That's all I can say, really. Really hope I get this. God, it's already like two seconds ahead. No flip trick from us. We're gonna have to go for the shroomless. Shroomless for us. But we're catching the ghost, which is really good. Oh, that wall hit so bad. Another horrible turn. Nice, we needed that. We're gonna have to clutch up at the end here. Oh my god, we actually beat it first try. <laughs> oh, let's go, dude. I was so nervous. Really good lap three, dude. That really clutched us. Clutch for us. 0. 0.3 off my PB. You can tell I've never TT'd this track. Oh, but a first try, we beat it, dude. Let's go. Peach Beach could be tricky. Um, the Ghost is just two seconds behind my PB, and my PB is pretty bad. And I don't know how to use the spear. Um, so... Wish me luck, guys. I thought they had two shrooms left for a second, and I got really scared. <laughs> yeah, we should be beating this one. Let's finish strong. Yeah, we're dead. Let's go. So, Yoshi Falls should be an easy one, however, um, with a couple uh, misinputs, could go horribly wrong. Um, so, like that. That was horrible. And now we're losing. <laughs> this is a spear track, however, um, as stated on Peach Beach, is I'm horrible with spear. And I've never TT'd this on spear either. So, um, 
Let's just stick to flame. Something I'm comfortable with. Good lap three, besides the ending. <laughs> we'll take it. Should be another easy one for us, as long as we don't fall off. Um, and yeah, let's see what we can do. Oh my god. <laughs> that could have been bad. Yeah, let's finish out. <laughs> that could have been really, really bad. But we still beat it, so. Let's and uh, we get another easy one here, playing Mario Raceway. Um, as long as we don't have to, f as long as we don't fail and like burn a shroom or something like that, this one should be easy. Um, speaking of that, we have to focus now because that was really, really bad. Um, yeah, I need to lock in. So gross. All right, you have a good lap here. Chain. Holy sh! Oh my god, dude. That had me so nervous. That had me so nervous. Oh my god. So, a little shooken up from that last race. It was a super, super close ending. Um, however, that let us. Uh, hopefully, that doesn't distract us because this is our first Magic Cruiser track. And um, this track, this ghost is pretty easy. The track is pretty easy. However,. Um, falling in one of the cracks or mistiming a hop on the shroom cut or something like that could be detrimental um, and completely kill the run to be honest. Um, however, the ghost is a 208 or something like that, so it should be pretty, pretty easy. Um, there we go. Should be good from here. I don't see us, uh, I don't see us throwing it away. And there we go. 206.5, beating it by about two seconds. So. We are yet again on the Magic Cruiser, um, which is a good thing. This track is super uh, consistent on Magic, and uh, you know that's what we're going for in this uh, challenge is consistency. So should be good. Just gotta make sure we don't go too tight and fall off in these little cracks. <laughs> uh oh, <laughs> we hit the crab, but we'll be fine. So. So, pretty horrible time, but we beat it. So, another easy staff ghost. As long as we don't hit any walls and, uh, you know, maybe fall off, we should be okay here. <laughs> no chain wheelies, but this ghost is not very good, so we should be fine. You'd hope, at least. <laughs> Honestly, I thought we were going to miss the trick because of the, the bridge going down, but looks like we're chilling. There we go. That's Delfino Square. Almost a 206, even with uh, no chains and horrible driving, so we'll take it. <laughs> so, we've got ourselves another easy one, even with that horrible start. Um... I've beaten this by about 11 seconds already, so uh, it should be pretty, pretty easy. As you can see on the mini map, we're already breaking away. And let's see if I can do the turn skip, but the ghost obviously doesn't do the turn skip, so we're not going to be able to make it from that angle. I made it messed up. And we got turn skip, one for three at least. But we don't need it. Look at the ghost, look at the mini map. <laughs> it's over. It's going to be RWS completed. 
There we go. So we got our easiest one today, probably. Uh, Andu, <laughs> whatever that combo is, the tiny tight end. Um, by PB, beats it by about almost like 10 seconds. So um, pretty good for us. Just gotta make sure we don't fail any any shrimp cuts. We should be should be golden. Seven point two. We'll beat it by about seven seconds. Um, we'll take it. So this is probably the second scariest or the most scariest track we're gonna be playing today. Um, and the reason for that is if we fail a low, hit a wall, burn a shroom, fail a shroom cut, anything, uh, we're not beating this ghost. So we need to go into overdrive here, make the cuts, even though that was uh, scuffed. <laughs> um, not fall on any cracks, but um, yeah, it should be easy other than that, but we just gotta make sure we don't fail. Going for the mini turbo that time, just gotta, even though we lost like a bunch of time on the cut, we didn't fall off and that's really all that matters. Uh, and yeah. Really good cut, really good alignment. Chain really, we're, we're beating this guy. Let's look at the mini map. It's over. Chain again. Chain again? Wow. That was a killer lap three. That lap three was so good. Yeah, 40.2. Wow. So, we did switch to Daisy for this course. We don't really necessarily need to use Daisy for this course, but um, I figured why not? My PB's on Daisy. Why not play it on Daisy? Um, we're only six tracks away from beating all 32 first try, which is insane. Um, nice turn, Skip. Um, yeah, but we just gotta finish out strong. This go shouldn't be too bad, especially since we do have the character advantage. Um, and the driving advantage. We're driving pretty, pretty well right now. Pretty tight turns. However, this cut up here could absolutely destroy me. Let's see what I can do. I'm just gonna take it wide, just in case. No, not worth failing. Over. And yeah, if we keep getting laps like that, 1.4 seconds ahead, if we keep getting laps like that, we'll, we'll be crushing this ghost. And there we go. 215.8. It's actually... Less than a second off my PB. <laughs> so, let's t we'll take it. Another fairly easy one here. RMC, GCN Mario Circuit. Um, racing versus the Mog Bike, Mr. Bean. Um, and as long as we don't have any horrible cuts or anything like that, get uh, eaten by the piranhas, we should be good here. Oh, nice. <laughs> nice one. Yeah, I lost about a second and a half at the beginning of the lap. Let's just finish that strong. Oh, that almost was the sickest double trick ever. <laughs> oh well, we beat it, so. We have four races left, one cup to go. Alright, RMC, a pure driving one. Um, we've beaten this ghost by over three seconds before. Um, however... I don't know if we're going to be doing that today. <laughs> um, our second Daisy track so far. And let's just not fail this cut. That's all I need to worry about is not failing the cut. And also being used to Daisy, because I've only used her one time in like the last couple months. <laughs> and that was a couple races ago. You know, maybe not the 118, but we beat the Staff Ghost and we are have three races left now. Um, so, yeah, let's do it. Alright, another easy one. Uh, honestly, let's just get to it. Yeah, we're killing it so far. I'm 
trying to be fancy there. <laughs> Plus one wall hit. Maybe we'll go for world record with that line. Are you kidding me? There we go. I did my fancy thing, lap three, and I didn't fail it. <laughs> All right, two tracks left. Let's see. Ya. Let's see what we can do, guys. So as you can see, DK Mountain, our last Daisy track, first thing Ando. Um, I'm kind of nervous because you know we're gonna we're gonna beat Ando quite easily. That was pretty cool. Um, we're gonna beat Ando quite easily. However, we have RBC N64 Bowser's Castle as our last track, and that one is, you know, I've beaten it before, and I'm pretty good at the track, but, um, you know, it's the last race, so I'm getting kind of nervous. You know, I've been playing for about an hour and 15 minutes already. Um, <laughs> would hate to throw it on the last race. Um, nice 43.5 lap right there. <laughs> but I would hate to throw it on RBC, our last race throughout the whole video. There, that was good. Pretty quick cut. We're gonna hold our last shroom for lap three to see how fast of a lap we can get. Um, and with this horrible beginning, it's not gonna be that good. <laughs> okay, let's not lose to the ghost. Holy, it's way too close. <laughs> get me away from Ando. All right, 213, guys. Horrible race, but we have one more race, RBC. Wish me luck. All right, so RBC, we're racing Russo, the Spanish MK Wii legend. Um, yeah, let's see if we can do it on the last race. Um, I'm gonna tr focus a little bit this race, but you know, I believe in I, I believe in myself. We're ahead. That's all that matters. Good cut here. Decent enough. We're off screen again. We're pretty far ahead. Another decent lap. 0.8 ahead now. This is looking really good for us. Just gotta close it out. I'm starting to get a little nervous, to be honest. <laughs> Let's do it. Quick flop cycles for us. Cycles. Let's get a good cut here too. Come on. Yeah, really good cut. Yeah, we're killing Russo right now. Holy. Okay. <laughs> Wait, are we gonna beat him? Uh oh. I forgot. Oh yeah, we're killing him. Let's go, dude. 233.995. I beat every single staff ghost in a row without resetting a single time. Holy. 